Inspirational, visionary and driven. Brilliant, hard worker and resilient. Happy, efficient and pragmatic. Calm, supportive uh, and, a, and a great collaborator. Leadership, collaboration and he likes to drink martinis. He is uh, one of the most committed person to intensive care medicine that I've ever met. You know, from his clinical skills at the bedside, uh, to his drive for research, to how he manages things, and to the commitment that he showed to the European Society of Intensive Care Medicine. Uh, and I met uh, Andy Rhodes about 10 years ago, uh, when I was his fellow, and he's been inspirational, we work together very well. And it's probably been through his mentoring that I've decided to become an intensivist uh, myself. We have been in many committees together and we had a very close relationship. He is always with a smile, trying always to help, but never forgetting his aim and the aim of our members. He is after Sir Winston Churchill, possibly the second the most resilient uh, British I ever met. Policy Mandy has been uh, working here uh, for a long time. I joined his team in 2011 and he has been my consultant and my research supervisor and he is also my mentor and supervisor of my research. So we have been working together for the three, four years now. Most of all is a really great doctor. Uh, Andy taught me from very early stages in my anaesthetic and intensive care training and supervised me for many years, first of all as a, as a doctor and, and then as a research trainee as well. He's been working in the background for many years internationally as well as in the UK, providing leadership and, and steering intensive care as a specialty as it develops. Uh, he's contributed in so many ways, in so many things that a lot of people just wouldn't be aware of and has been a, a very effective leader for our specialty. I've worked with Andy over the past 10 years on many projects, in particular the Surviving Sepsis Campaign. The success of the campaign, in no small measure, is due to Andy's exceptional leadership skills, his support during his presidency, and his particular people skills that have enabled the campaign to achieve the success of 25% reduction in mortality that marked this successful effort. Congratulations and well deserved, Andy. I'm honoured, humbled, um, but absolutely delighted. Um, I've been part of the European Society of Intensive Care Medicine for a long time. I've, it's been my life, it's where my friends are, it's where my colleagues are. It's actually something I've aspired to do is to be taking leadership positions in the society and I achieved that and I, I think we delivered a lot. To be now recognised by the people who I see as my mentors and who I've aspired to live up to for all these years is something that I, I'm absolutely honoured by. Um, it's something that um, I will always remember um, and thank you very much.